new business is coming to downtown Lawrenceburg next week, and it's catering to all you cat lovers mm -hmm. out there. Bourbon Tales Cat Cafe will open in the heart of downtown, but there's inspiration behind the art that can be seen from the outside. Evening Edition's Austin Pollock has tonight's Positively LEX 18. In this box are the colors to make this wall shine. The wall that can be seen from the heart of downtown Lawrenceburg. So I think it will bring a lot of attention, especially being down on Main Street. Um, the, you know, cat lovers will be all over it. It'll be a big hit. Hannah Wedding painted one of the cats on this soon to be mural at what will soon be Bourbon Tales Cat Cafe. The purpose of the cafe is to not only provide an activity for the community, but to also help the cats get more exposure. I've got three cats, four dogs, a rabbit, two fish, three snails. Regina Stratton painted another cat on the wall, an Anderson County resident. She's optimistic increased traffic will be a benefit. And now that we're on the Bourbon Trail, it seems like there's a lot more traffic going up and down Main Street and more chances for the cats to be adopted. Becca Bayless is the operations manager. This is joint, just going to showcase them and um, show people that, you know, cats are great, um, just like dogs. She tells me this room in particular has a special purpose called the Princess Ivy Cat Lounge. Paula Mullins founded the Anderson County Shelter Friends in 2019. Sadly, she died in 2021, and one of her wishes was to honor her granddaughter, Princess Ivy. Princess Ivy loves to travel and enjoys going to the movies and Broadway shows. This room will accommodate those needing easier access for wheelchairs, kids groups, and private events. This room is dedicated in Princess Ivy's honor. In Anderson County, Austin Pollock, Evening Edition. Well, the Cat Cafe will have some soft openings for friends and family. And they plan to open to the public a week from tomorrow. If you know of some good news happening in your community, let us know. Send us an email to PositivelyLEX18 at WLEX.TV.